You're right, guys, it's Capgun Tom here, and I'm back for another episode of Road to Glory. This is episode M number 89, so we're getting almost to that century of episode, which is pretty cool. Anyway, I first want to start off by saying um, I've been coming under a lot of criticism in the last couple of episodes, saying that I don't do enough skill um, when I'm playing, uh, considering I'm using a Brazil skill team, which is kind of fair enough. But um, one thing I will say is that uh, because I show you every single game I play, um, a lot of the goals, you know, I will be trying to get the win. I'm not going to try and, you know, skill my way to a loss. I'm going to try and get the win, even if that means I don't have to score a couple of not-so-nice goals. Um, basically, um, people who do montage and stuff, if you're expecting that sort of quality, um, you're in for a big shock because, you know, people spend months, like we're talking hundreds and hundreds of games, um, played to get that footage that will allow them to put that sort of quality video out so if you're expecting that sort of quality then you're out of luck because there's no way that I could do that in what is I only play 30 games with each team so there's just no way but what I am going to do is I'm going to um, go away and make a montage of like some of the goals I scored during this uh, this team uh, just to show you that like maybe you're forgetting some of the goals I have scored because I have scored some quite nice goals during this uh um, during this team so um, we'll leave it there I'll leave the moaning out but anyway um, you see there we got our first win in the episode we won 2-0 uh, we went away and we made a tra uh, signing I decided to go and get Nene um, I was going to get Wellington Silver um, a lot of you wanted me to get Wellington Silver but unfortunately there was no 442 versions of him on the market and um, the ones that were on the market were outrageously priced they were like we're talking like twice the price of a, of a normal one of in a different formation so I was just like nope not going to happen um, I've never used Nene before and I've heard a lot about him so I thought oh, it would be cool if I could try him out so um, that's what I decided to do and this was actually a very nice goal um, really good passing movement all the way from the halfway line as you can see and uh, Ronaldinho finished it off with a nice volley so um, there was quite a nice goal in the last episode as well that involved the uh, not last episode, uh, last game involving the scoop turn and uh, what was a Rabona to volley, which was quite a nice goal as well, if you missed it. Anyway, um, you can see there we get our second goal through Ronaldinho again. His defence just passing like the Red Sea, uh, simply walking through and scoring. Um, but he did get one back, you can see here, um, that he blasted his way through. I'm not even sure how that really happened. I thought I had it covered, but uh, apparently his Kribari guy just uh, walked through me and uh, ended up getting a goal, but it wasn't enough for him. Uh, he didn't make the comeback because we uh, hang on to the end and we get another win. So that is a 2-1 uh, victory to us, which is pretty cool. Always looking for those victories. And uh, that's the second win of the episode. So I um, decided to go off and uh, make a signing and I read a lot of your comments and people were saying that Inform Fabio is one of the best Brazilian keepers on the game. A lot of people said Inform Helton is also very good um, and I've used Inform Helton before and uh, I was impressed I won't lie uh, but I thought it would be a good idea to go and try someone different for my own knowledge so in the future if I do need a Brazilian goalkeeper I know which one I want um, I'll give you my opinion on that um, at the end of this uh, at the end of this team in the next episode and I'll also tell you what I think about Ronaldinho as a striker anyway um, we go off into our last game we come up against a typical 4-2-3-1 um, Brazilian team and um, I have to say um, I didn't enjoy this game at all you can see there I got the first goal pretty standard Wallison just standing in the space and uh, turning and shooting um, unfortunately this guy did manage to um, equalize um, Roberto Carlos coming out of nowhere and scoring an absolute blitzer uh, not even with his left foot uh, from outside the box so uh, pretty good goal from there um, and uh, he actually takes the lead, you can see uh, here uh, through this corner. Now, I felt pretty uh, robbed during this game. I mean, uh, you'll see at the end, I always, if I feel like I've been robbed, I head straight to the match facts to see what the stats were. And you can see here, this is no exception because I did end up losing 2-1. And I did feel that I had been a bit hard done by not to just get, not, you know, a draw would have been acceptable, but I didn't think a loss was uh, really that fair. Anyway, guys, um, I hope you've enjoyed this this episode please leave a like if you have um like i said i'll make a montage of some of the goals i've scored with this team and i hope you enjoy it and i hope you enjoyed this too and i guess i'll leave it there and i'll see you all next time